So a warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. And our live game is Nice against Paris Saint-Germain. This is Peter Drury and next to me providing insights will be Jim Beglin. Thanks Peter, it's a pleasure and a privilege for me to be here. Two starting lineups. Tries a through ball. Balls loose, who's getting there? Di Maria. Idris again. Thrust towards the front line. And it's messy. Cuts it out. Good ball through. Messi. Messi hits it! Danger averted for now. Gay. Passes it through. Aimed in towards the centre. Firmly met. Going for goal! Goal! Paris Saint-Germain! And Paris Saint-Germain take the lead! Messi just stayed on the right side of the defender there. I thought he showed wonderful patience, great experience to just make sure he didn't drift offside. And I just thought all around it was very intelligent play. Saint-Germain ahead, one goal to the good. Paris Saint-Germain are already ahead, the perfect start. Well, they've managed to get their noses in front early because they've been much quicker out of the stalls. They've set a high tempo and intensity and look as though they, they want it much more at the moment. In the end, they found themselves penned in, nowhere to go. Tries to dink it in. He slid it through. Oh, that probably deserved better. Oh, is that really good enough? The delivery was pinpoint for me, very, very accurate, yet he failed to convert it, and he has to find a bit more composure than that. Played it short. Nice with another corner. And it's been taken short. Neymar. Force his way through. 
Well, there's no way I'm accusing him of being selfish, Peter. He had no support. It's a long forward pass. Aim forward. Looks to thread it through. A very fortunate escape indeed. Well, what can you say about that? It's difficult to know whether to criticise or, or sympathise. I'll favour the latter because we've all done it. You take your eye off the ball and everyone feels let down. Nothing wrong with that tackle. Ball won cleanly. Nearly half an hour gone here. So they got the only goal to give them a 1 0 lead. Messi, big chance! It's a goal! Two up and threatening to pull clear. <laughs> Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it and. That was a good example, great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Paris Saint-Germain get themselves a two-goal cushion. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Idrissa Gay boots it upfield. And it's Di Maria. Looks to slip it through. And the defence can get it clear. Di Maria tried to play it through. Yeah, and the vision to get him through was all good, but the execution of the pass wasn't quite right. But importantly, he's holding his line until the very last moment, and that will pay off. Di Maria. Uh, ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Lops it in gently. He's made sure that that won't get through. Ball's gone out of play. Marco Verratti pumps it upfield. Now it's Neymar. Played the ball, that's a foul. Oh, that's a booking, always looked it. And it's Neymar. Neymar looks to dink one in. They've managed to get it away. And that'll be the last act of the first half. Some first half thoughts? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Paris Saint Germain sitting pretty here at half time, 2 0 up. Start of the second half. <laughs> Neymar needed to come up with a better ball. The idea was good though, Peter, and I like the run that triggered the pass, but the quality was the problem. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. The referee has shown him a yellow card. Well, what goes through a player's head at times like that is a mystery to me.
that's good defence. Uh, plain and simple, good defence. They refuse to allow a turn. Short. Who's going to make this theirs? Di Maria goes wide. He's in space and looking for options. Knocks it towards the front. Now it's Messi. Messi passes it through. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No, it's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. Get that clear. Right place, right time. Um, it was just as well the defender was on hand to, uh, to mop it up. It's a long pass towards the front. Marco Verratti battles to win it back. Still going. Where to next? Forward it goes. Marco Verratti tries the route one option. And he's being judged offside. Oh, it looked like a training ground drill that almost worked a treat, only for that flag to go up. He just went a tad early. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. <laughs> Tries a through ball. Now it's Messi. Pumps it forwards. Draxler. Well, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Verratti goes long and forward. Tries to get it forward quickly. Paris Saint-Germain may be thinking about substitutions now. They still have two available. Aim forward. Now here's the through ball. Nicely controlled. Idrissa Gay. Very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. Out to the left it goes. Ball's out on the left now. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Marco Verratti. Oh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Well, he simply failed to just put a little more oomph behind that. Now it's Berati. He's off on a marauding run. Good clearance and very necessary. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Oh, just when we were about to appreciate a lovely one-touch pass, the flag ruined the moment. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Marquinhos gets good distance on it. Messi is on the end of some really unwanted attention. Yeah, and now that he scored, this defence is on high alert whenever he, he goes anywhere near the ball. He's in! Dante can hoist it clear. it back well, that looks a foul yep, referee's given it just five minutes left 
floats one over. And he's there to hoof it away. He's gone out for a throw-in. Draxler, spoon forward. Now the pass. Aimed long and direct. This official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. And out to safety. Idrissa Gay battles to win it back. And it's Draxler. Draxler with the ball through. Away from immediate danger. And that is it, the referee has seen enough. Solid, if not especially fancy, always in control, they did enough to win it. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Paris Saint-Germain kept such a, a high defensive line and squeezed the game with, with really good pressure on the ball and it made the big difference. It helped them to control things to their liking. And